Go check out buycheapfifacoins.com to get the best cheap coins around on the market. Use the discount code ROSSI for an extra discount off your coins. It's a fully automated service. So you get your coins instantly. What more could you ask for? Now let's roll on to today's video. Hello guys, Mr. Ross1990 here, and this is episode 189 of the Random Hybrid. If you're adding to smash the like button, that would be absolutely amazing. Also, if you're new to my channel, if you hit the subscribe button, that would be pretty cool too. It's Sunday, so therefore, it is a live episode. What I mean by live, if you don't know, is basically, normally I would cut out the parts of me making the team and all that stuff, but you guys like to see that on a Sunday. You actually guys like to see that most of the time. You seem to prefer that, but a Sunday I said I'll do it because it's a day, you know, a lot of people have... Sunday nights off, it's like a chilled period, I know a lot of people don't, um, but the majority do, people back at school now, jobs, you know, not many people work a Sunday night, that's very unlucky if you do, I feel for you, I work Sunday mornings, which sucks ass, but yes, uh, today's episode we're going to be using the AC Milan Fernando Torres, now it might be a little bit of a weird when you think, why the hell aren't you using some of the new informs, one reason for that is I don't have the bloody coins for it, I just can't sell anything at the moment, I don't know what's happening with the market, people are dropping down in price, I'm trying to make as much as I can to, uh, you know, get as many coins as I can, obviously, but they seem to not be selling and I haven't been on in a few days so that could be the reason but Torres interests me purely because when I use his Chelsea card he wasn't bad at all for me I actually quite liked him and now he's at AC Milan a different league uh, it's cool for hybrids in my opinion so we're going to be using him and obviously two other players I'll so just put the criteria on now I've got about 300k so we're not exactly skint but you know you guys know I like to have a million plus to uh, uh, prepare myself with but we're going to go for page number seven and I am going to pick my own because I like to I like to do that sometimes. But yes, page seven. Hopefully we can get some pretty good players on the page. Got think Torres, Spanish, Syria, AC Milan. It's all it's all ticking all the boxes, isn't it? This page is is is. Oh, hello. I've actually got not a bad bunch of players. Philippe Lahm, Eto, Charla. You know, all right players. Falcao we used in the last episode, so I won't use him this time. Sturridge there, who isn't bad. Peter Chak, obviously, Larm. Larm's actually a CDM in FIFA 15. I think the official rating's been out of him. I can't remember what he was rating, but he's a CDM. And, like, Javi Martinez as a centre-back. It's all very weird. Um, who do we have off that page? That is a, that is a thinker. Eto is there. Obviously, he's got an Everton card now as well, which is a strange move, in my opinion. Didn't really see that one coming, but... Sherla's a very good card in this game. I do really like using Sherla. But somebody as, as easy as Carl Walker, somebody like that, we could just chuck in a team and uh, and go from there. I'm actually quite tempted to use Carl Walker now. We're going to use Carl Walker. A lot of people are probably thinking, what the fuck? But why the hell not? Why the hell not? We'll use Carl Walker, give him a go, and uh, see how he does. So we've got Carl Walker, we've got Fernando Torres, we're going to get one more player, and then we could go into making our hybrid of doom. Hopefully it turns out quite good. We're going to go for like 22k, page 7. See who we can get. So hopefully we can get somebody quite good. Was that a 1.3 million bid on someone there? I don't know who the hell that was. I think it might have been Cliver actually, which is uh, expensive. But who are we going to get on page 7? We've got Louis. We've also got Higuain. Holy shit, this is a page for high rated players. We've got David Silver there, who. Uh, hold on, David Silver might actually be a good shout because I'll probably use him anyway. Thinking about it, Torres Spanish linking him to Carl Walker in somehow. Would, uh, David Silver is. Uh, uh, one of the um, obvious options. Higuain, though, is in that league. Higuain, motherfucking mean. Berg, meh. He's, he actually looks quite good. A nice shot on him. I think I've used him once twice before. Schweini is a good player to have. Aguero, for obvious reasons. We're going to have David Silva. We're actually going to have David Silva off that page. The uh, reason that is I probably was going to use him in a team anyway. So it frees up a spot to uh, um, do that, basically. And I've already got one in my club, so I don't have to go out and buy one. So that is this part of the video, guys, done. I'll be back in two seconds. I'm going to sort out the team. So I'll see you over at the squad screen. Okay, so we're over at the squad screen now. We've got Torres in there. And the formation I'm thinking of using is this one right here. Now... It's got a lot more links than I remember. It's because I've been playing the uh, FIFA 15 B. I won't say anymore. But <laughs> not allowed to say anything about that. But um, that might make sense if you've seen any of the formations. But okay, we'll move over to putting David Silver in the team. I'm pretty sure I've got one. If I haven't, then that is annoying. But um, camp for Manchester City. Yes, we do. We've got David Silver. Spanish League to Torres. Happy days. Carl Walker is our second player. I don't know why the hell I just changed that from Premier League. But um, if you hear me clicking my um, joypad, it's because for some reason my D-pad on my controller is really freaking loud when I press it now. I don't know what's happened there, but it's gone really loud. I might have, you know, raged a little bit and dropped on the floor and it's uh, 
It's broken, but what can you do? Um, I'm thinking big time, Eric Lamella. I know he's got an inform. Andos Townsend would, would be good as well. But Eric Lamella. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Then we could have a seat. Could even go with someone like Javi Garcia. Because then he gets... Um, that was his name. David Silva. What other CDMs have I got from Spain in the Premier League? What options have we got? Javi Garcia, which is obvious. Is there any centre mids? Got, oh, we've got Fabregas from Chelsea. We've got Fabregas from Chelsea indeed. We've also got Ander Herrera from Man United, obviously. But um, Javi Garcia would open us up a little bit better because then he gets that strong link. How many dead links? Oh my god, there's so many links to the cam. It is crazy. So we've got half link, half link, full link. Uh, dead, dead, dead. Um, I could get away with two deads. So if I just had possibly Spanish people down here. For the left side, we're going to have to have an AC Milan player or a Spanish player in that league. So I'm pretty confident it's going to have to be an AC Milan player, if I'm being totally honest. Because um, we've got... I've got oh, shit. I completely forgot about Tarab. Temden. I was thinking El Shawa, Bada, Ding Dong. Have I even got one? Is the question. Yes, I do. We've also got Jeremy Menez, who... That's different, isn't it? That's a different player um, to El Shuari. Very, I like El Shuari now. He's four-star skills. It'd be nice to use him, actually. I don't think I've used him since he's been upgraded to four-star skills. Obviously, he gets a strong link there. Um, that's cool. That's totally fine. Um, we can go with Spanish centre-backs, I guess. That's going into the BBVA, of course. What Spanish centre-backs have I got in the BBVA? Just straight-up Spanish. We've got, of course, Ramos. Inigo Martinez is a very nice one to have. Just put Inigo Martinez and Ramos in here a second. Because they're pace and they're fantastic. David Silva, if I just chucked in any random... I'm pretty sure, but my I haven't played it in a while and uh, it's off putting. If I just chuck in Toulon, say... Yeah, Silva would get the chem. Silva would definitely get the chem just by doing that. Um, cool. So if I go and have... How many play Spanish players am I having here? If I have... Oh, if I have a... Sorry, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going a little bit crazy. If I have a Real Madrid goalkeeper, if I have... Who should transfer to Real Madrid? I think as a goalkeeper who transferred to Real Madrid, I can get one, two, three, four, five... That's six Spanish. Meh. I'd rather not. I'd rather not. One, two, three... Um... I might change the goalkeeper if I can. Let's have a look. One, two, one, two... Yeah. Yeah, I could get away with that being any Real Madrid goalkeeper. So, if there is a transfer, I can't remember who the hell they bought. But they've, they've signed a goalkeeper. I know that to be true. Right, we need a we need a Serie A CDM. Where the hell am I going? We need the rock that is Daniele De Rossi, I reckon. I just It has to be. It just has to be Daniele De Rossi. Um, left back, what options have I got now? Armero won't do. Ashley freaking Cole. The left-back options are just eight. They really are. Holy shit, I didn't realize that guy was a left-back. That's new. Kevin Constant. Oh, I wouldn't get De Rossi the Kevin. Bollocks. We actually need a left-back from Italy then. So that's annoying. I'm going to have to have a look on the market actually for that. Because just to see if there's any new transferred ones. Because look what I've got. I like Balzare. Or as I like to know, balls are sweaty. So, um, and you get an ultimate link as well. So that, it's not a problem me using him. But I, I just I want to see if there's any like new transferred players gone over to the left back position. So we want to go look on the market for. I want to get an informed Eric Lamella if I can afford one. If not, I'm gonna have to make do with the original. Um, I'm gonna look for a Real Madrid goalkeeper and I'm gonna look for a left back from Italy who is Italian. So we're gonna go over to the market and see what we can do. Right, first thing we're gonna do is go straight to Syria and have a look for these left back options we've got. They've got to be. I think they've got to be Italian. They possibly could just play for Roma. I'm thinking maybe actually Cole might be a good, might be a good cheeky shout there. Who's this guy? Is he new? None not look great though, does he? It's, it's just really depressing when you're looking at left backs from Serie A, who are Italian. I mean, you expect to see good players, but a lot of them play um, like three at the back or wing backs, and they're down as like left mids and stuff. And um, I guess that's just what it is. That guy's not too bad for a bronze. I'm, I'm pretty sure I could get away with a Roma one. Let's just double check that Roma haven't got. Another left back. They've got balls of sway and they've got. I think they've got Ashley Cole in there. Am I getting that horribly wrong? No, they have got Ashley Cole. Oh, they've got Emanuelson as well. Holy shit, they've done well for left backs now. I'd be half tempted to use him. He's not a left back if you look at his stats. There's everything but. But. But, but. 
what what in the butt? But we're gonna we're gonna use him, I reckon. We're gonna give him a go. If, if I can, if I can, then we will use Balls of Sway or Bowseretti, sorry, and um, we'll definitely go about doing that. But we're gonna have a quick check for Real Madrid goalkeepers. I haven't been up to date with the transfers, so I mean, in the game, I know I know they've definitely bought a goalkeeper. I just can't for the life of me remember who it is. It will hit me as soon as I see him for obvious reasons, but um, I can't bloody remember. Navas, that's the bugger. Is he a silver? He's a silver. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Okay. Kalor Navas. Shit, that's actually really annoying. He's a silver card. Of course, I'm used to seeing him being like a, a green or a blue, but um, his basic was a silver. Way underrated. Don't know what he's going to be in the next FIFA, but I imagine he hits gold. That would make sense because he's a fantastic goalkeeper. Yeah, we're going to buy Kalor Navas, which is... It's weird, isn't it? It's very strange. He's Costa Rican, so we'll chuck that in here. We'll do it for shits and gigs, and um, I honestly thought it would be better rated, but... Who am I to judge? Apparently EA know their shit. Let's have a look how many there is on the market. 7k-ish, 6.5k. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, about 6.5k is not too bad, I suppose. We can, we can just about pay that. Hold on, there's a 6.2 there, was there? I swear i just seen 6.2. Am I going completely crazy? There he is, 6.2. And he's got a card on him, but to be fair, it's only speed. So, yeah, we'll buy this one, and I'll be right back. Right, so let's go check what Eric Lamella is currently going for. He's obviously a Tottenham player. Um, Spur, isn't it? That's it. And we're going to do Argentine, Gold. I don't know what his preset position is. So I'm just going to put 10k on, because I imagine his, his regular card doesn't go for much at the moment. And his inform card, I have no idea what it goes for not a clue so i could be horribly wrong he might go for like 400 500k or he could go for 40k oh yes we're buying him and to be fair he, he gets off put because of his pace and his skill moves but he's a really good player he is such a good player i hope he has a great season at tottenham for just just the fact that he deserves to have a good season i'd like to see him go back to five star skills that ain't gonna happen he's not you know not an amazing skiller um, as such, but four star skills possibly next year would be cool. I'm gonna go buy one of these. I'll skip this part because it's boring as hell, and I'll meet you over at the squad screen. Okay, so I'm back. Has changed what we have. Well, what we've changed basically. So we're gonna go with a Real Madrid silver goalkeeper. Still depresses me to say that. It's Kalor Navas. Like I said, the card name is only a speed, so um, yeah, that still gets all chemistry fine. Let's just double check. We can, we can use on. Um, um, What's he called? The Roma guy, the the um, Dutch one. Do I want to use him or do I want to use Ashley Cole? Ashley Cole's a solid left back. You get what you get with Ashley Cole, but this guy's somebody I haven't tried yet, and um, that's always nice. He does get the can we need, obviously, for playing for the same team. Oh, yeah, there's only two dead links. For some reason I thought there's three dead links, uh, but there is only two, so that's fine. And then we do go out and buy, of course, Eric Lamella's um, Informer. When I went out actually bought him in a Hunter chemistry style for about the same price they was all going for, so I got a little bit of pace and um, shooting with my card, so I'm not too bothered about that at all. That looks like a really good team, in my opinion. It's got three different leagues, of course, the Premier League, the Italian League, and, of course, the Liga BBBA. It's got a mixture of different nationalities. You've got one, you know, could say a few Spanish players, but I did do my best to chuck one out. I got rid of the Spanish goalkeeper to go for a Costa Rican goalkeeper. Um, you could, I suppose, change it up and go a little bit more Premier League if you want to get rid of the Spanish ones, but then you're having too many Premier League players. It's a different side of that, that, you know, the same reason, basically. So that is the team. I'm looking forward to using this team, actually. You've got a very nice set of players. Different different players that I, I wouldn't normally use, and honestly, there's not a lot of pace in that team, is there? I mean, the centre-backs are quite pacey, but right mid's not pacey, strike's not pacey, your cam isn't exactly rapid, your left wing, El is pretty pacey, he's got 87 pace, but apart from that, it's not the quickest team I've ever played with, and I'm not saying I have a pace haul, but pace is nice, not going to lie to you, hopefully uh, um, I can do well with this team, though. The card on Navas, like I said, isn't going to affect him that much, I get a lot of comments saying, oh, you play a card on him, I would make sure to show you it's just his speed so he might be like a little ninja around the goal but that's about it but i think he deserves that card anyway because he's a beast in real life and he'll definitely get an upgrade for sure in fifa 15 but that is his part of the video video we're gonna go find ourselves an opponent and i'll be right back when we found him so let's do this okay this is our our opponent he's got two strange choices in the goalkeeper and of course Benzema in striker in cam linking with absolutely no one that's probably why he's got 86 chemistry didn't actually see that but, let's 
still a good team. Still a good team. He's got pace everywhere. Literally, the strike force is fucking rapid. But hopefully, we've picked a good enough team to beat it. So let's oh, well, do well, this. Lamella's doing well. Eric. Torres, little dink over the top. Go on, Eric. Eric Lamella, lobbed the goalkeeper. No, fucked it up. El Shawari. Oh, shit. That's how we do. That is a great header from El Shawari. Nice little through ball, actually, from Torres originally to Lamella, who just misses out on the chip shot. But who's there? El Shawari, of all people, actually scores a header. Who knew? 1 0, four minutes gone. Ah, game Torres. out. Torres. Oh, ball horrendous. Oh, shit. David Silva. Nicked in. David Silva. How's your cross shot? Silva. Oh, that's an absolute beautiful goal for 2-0 right into the top corner. I just love it when they hit it like that. That is absolutely beautiful to look at. Bang. Here it comes. Oh, we're going to miss a replay. But holy shit. 2-0. And we're comfortable in the lead now. Game on. I went for a ball roll. And fucked it. Oh, the ball's still gone through. It's Fernando Torres. He's going to score. Ah, he does as well. If we miss for a second, 3-0. We're running right in this game. This guy can't handle us. His chemistry, you know, it's affecting him. It really is, you can tell. He's not a bad player, but it's just I'm finding gaps, and I'm taking abuse. He's going to rage quit just now, I would imagine. 3-0, and he's gone. We're going to go to match number two and see what we can do. Okay, match number two, and again, chemistry is down. He's got a bronze left back. But apart from that, it's, it, it's not a great team, actually. It really isn't, but... I've lost the worst. I've definitely lost the worst teams than that. And um, going into this, you never... I, I, I don't know. I should win this game, but who am I to judge? Game on, second game. He was offside. Oh, no. No, 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 no. What the hell was that? I expect a clean tackle, Kyle. For some reason, you decided to muller him from behind. Christ, we're going to wear cheap as shit, penalty. We're under the cosh here. We're not having the best of time. The passing is broke. And for some reason, this guy's bitch slapping me. But he's got a bloody penalty. What can we do? Kaylor Navas, a silver in goal. Oh, I fucking fucked it. And we, it's a goal. We're 1-0 down, and I have no idea how. I've literally not started this game well at all. We're approaching halftime in 30th minute. And it doesn't even look good. It really doesn't. Unless I change my way, we're going to struggle here. But game on. We'll Torres at moment. No, it's just, it just peers out into nothing. It's literally AIDS. We've done bugger all all game. And that's half time. We're having a shocker here. We're absolutely having a shocker. I mean, it's a nothing game. It's the most, one of the most boring games I've played in a long time. But I can't get anything going at all. It has been absolute AIDS. And look at that, I'm getting the ball away from fucking kickoff here. But holy tits. It's game on. And we better bloody win this game. No, look at that. Look at if that leads to a chance. You can actually fuck off. You can actually fuck off if this leads to a chance. Oh my god, no way. Just get that fucking clear of here. This is this is broke, man. This is shocking. This is the worst I've had it, and it's one of the reasons I don't want to play this game anymore. Come on, Torres, you fucker. He just needs to be quicker. I was supposed to pass it around quite well, to be fair to him. It's a good little ball out wide to, to Co. Nah, look at the bullshit. Look, he's going to tramp it as well. Nah, that was nice. Fair play to him. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. You can actually shut up. Oh, my God. Really? Really? It was, yeah, he got in behind. I'm pretty sure the shot's going wide. My guys decided to walk in front of it and let it go in. That's fine. Not a problem with that. Not a problem at all. Why isn't anybody moving? That's my problem. I'm sure this is better. Got to fucking finesse one home. I'm sure I go for goal. Wide. See, I don't get any luck. No pigeon flies by and heads that one home, does it, you bastards? Give it to me. Well, that's cracking. That's top draw. David Silva. In on goal. Just fucking finish it, David. Yes, get in. Nice little finish after I thought he fucked it. Pick up the ball, please. No, fine. Gang bang in the corner. Whatever you want to do. 2-1. 65th minute. My voice is breaking, apparently. And holy tit balls. That was, that's an absolute beautiful ball. Fernando Torres. Fucking finally. 2-all. Apologies for my language, but I don't give a shit no more. 2-all. Back in the game. Well, we're in the game. We're heavily in the game. 
Oh my god, we deserve that so much. I don't even know what the hell's gone on in this game, but so much AIDS it actually hurts my brain. There's still time for more AIDS, don't you worry about that. But let's motherfucking game out. Right, we're going extra time and penalties. I don't understand how this game's too all. It's ridiculous. It is actually ridiculous. We've all had games like this. I'm having one right now. I'm having a mare. I'm actually having a mare. It wouldn't surprise me if he goes on scores right now because it's just all gone tits. Nice. Nice touch from Lamella. Literally. Oh, this is cracking. Go on, Silver. No. I had enough of you. That's cr oh, that's top. That is top. Fernando Torres. Back in your Liverpool days. Fucking finish that. Oh, nice. I thought I fucked it. I honestly thought I'd ruined the chance by cutting that in and not running it towards goal. It was panic when the goalkeeper starts coming out. I've picked the corner. Fernando Torres. Roll back his Liverpool days. And he slots one home quite nicely. We finally got in the lead. I'm pretty sure we were 2-0 down. So that's a great little comeback against a team we really should be thrashing. But I'll take it. 3-2. Yeah, man. Oh, David Silva is 8. That's a beautiful ball. That's the equaliser right there. That is a cracking goal. Fair play to him. That is literally beautiful. Why can't my players do that? Literally, that is fantastic goal. Fair play. Back in the game. It's fuck. Literally. Fuck. Oh, this is nice. Torres. I'll tell you what. Fernando, we'll take it. We'll freaking take the disease. Thank you. Thank you, the A gods, for finally giving me some disease. That sounds weird to say, but I'll fucking take it. 4 3. We're back in the lead. Doing some skills and he's literally that could be in. Oh it is. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. You are joking me. Wow. Wow wow wow. What what do you what can you even say? What can you even say? I mean what is that? Goldie's had a mare, it's hit the post, gone in. Fucking lovely. Fantastic. Ah, uh, it's four all. It's four all. Unbelievably. And we still got a half to go. Best motherfucking game out. No, don't blow up there. Fuck off, referee. Bloody penalties. I hate penalties with a passion fruit fucking knob. Wow, it's gone in. Thank you. Holy shit. It's fucking she has been bitch slapping me all game. Ah, it's down the fucking middle, bitch. Christ's sake. I honestly hate penalties. I've probably missed that, to be fair. No, it's a good pen. Keeper's been floored by it, for Christ's sake. Now, oh, come on. No, Christ! Getting this horribly wrong. Literally can't be asked. Ding dong. We had a quite quiet game, to be fair. Good pen. Solid pen. I'll take that. A goal's a goal on all that jizz. Right, come on. Firmino. He had a good game. And that is fucking bullcrap because I dived. Not that way, but I dived. My goalkeeper just stood still. Like a little bitch whore. Eric Lamella had a shite game. Good pen, though. Straight down the middle again. Come on. Please, Tony Cruz. Suck my ball back. Yes! Good save. Kaylor Navas. Thank Christ for that. Don't game clip record right now. You're mugging me off. De Rossi, he had a solid game. Cracking pen. Is that the match or have we got one more? No, that's the match. Yes! Thank you very much. That game was AIDS and to come out with the win is pleasing. It really is. Wow. The, I just, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Fernando Torres apparently scored a, what was that, a hat-trick and then another one? But I think one of them was probably the penalty, of course. Um, wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know what happened to this team in this game, but the first game, when the guy rage quit, fantastic. It felt good to play. It's going to kick me out and say I've... <laughs> it would be the ultimate AIDS. No, I was going to say, it's, it sometimes says like you've been kicked out of the EA servers there. But um, no. We've done we've done well to win that game, considering it just it just felt bad. It felt really... I don't know. I mean, look where his goal was from, one of his. I don't know if that's my keeper's fault or what. But wow. Jesus Christ. He played well, though, to be fair. Had a really good game. Uh, decent, you know, did well. But we've, we've come out with the win, and I feel as if we probably deserve that on overall, like, shots and pressure. But that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. If you have a like, it would be absolutely amazing. If you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button for FIFA 15 content very soon. Have a nice day. I'll see you again soon. And bye-bye. Boom.